it's good to get those turnovers. Um, it's better when we have execution. So we're, we're getting these turnovers off of executing the defense, which is really good, um, as opposed to just tip balls and things like that. So um, I think guys are, are really understanding the defense and what Rob Ryan wants. And we're coming out here, we're executing, and we're making plays off of it. Yeah, we're able to get our hands on some of those footballs and uh, come up with a pick. And that's, and that's something we definitely want to get back to doing as a defense. So. Uh, to start out like that, that was definitely uh, encouraging. Exactly. That, that is a sign that we're picking it up. Um, it's also a sign of Rob Ryan's defense, a little more aggressive. Uh, he wants to get after it. And uh, for us to execute doesn't mean we're always going to be right. Um, but as long as we're fast and we're aggressive. Uh, I don't think my role is any different. I still call it defense. I'm still on the field. Uh, the only thing different would be the scheme. But you know, that's, that's going to come with a new coach. Um, so that's nothing. Uh, that, that's to be expected, and uh, I think I'm fitting in well right now. Uh, you know, it's the first day, and we'll see how it goes. Um, you know, I'd like to say I'm pretty comfortable. I, although, as you've seen, I've, I've seen, played both sides of the ball. I'm more comfortable on the left side, but I'm getting more comfortable on the right side. I'm working on that side. You know, it's been great, really, for the OTAs. We got a real good uh, feel for each other in OTAs. Um, you know, last year there was there was a lot of uncertainty, especially if I was going to keep playing or wasn't going to keep playing. Uh, what position was they going to play when I got back? You know, now we have uh, we have our roles, we have our defined roles, and we're able to play off each other. Um, and you know, it, it's good for for me, good for him, where he has certain strengths and weaknesses. I have certain strengths and weaknesses, and we just play off each other. That's a lot of weight on the D line this year. A lot of uh, a lot of big boys, a lot of a lot of big men. And uh, what's so great about it is everybody can move. Everybody's pretty nimble on their feet. And uh, that's what I'm most excited about being part of D-line. Such as I this mean, it, 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 three fours gives us trouble because we don't see it as much. Right. And to be able to see that every day will do nothing but help us. I think uh, when we come into the games and we play the teams that are three four defenses, um, not to say that the four three de defenses won't give us trouble too, but you know, once you can see it every day, it can definitely help us out. Yeah, I think that, you know, and that's it's getting back to what we used to do. You know, man up, uh, and you let more people to uh, you have more people to rush the quarterback, get pressure, um, and it helps us on the back end because it's less time to cover as well. Um, it gives you know the D-line and the blitzers a little bit more time to get there when you got those guys that can just line up and cover receivers. No, I play offense. I don't want them to win any any reps, any routes, anything. Um, I'd be lying to you if I said, yeah, it's great to see them. No, we, we want to kick their butt every day. And when we don't, we're upset. I mean, that's, that's the nature of the business. The competitiveness never leaves us. Um, you know, we'd be foolish if we came out here and said, well, you know what, they beat us today. And if you can just walk away like that, then you're in the wrong business.